Hello and welcome to Doom Pigeon Gaming. I'm Sarah Nightmare and today I'm playing The Wolf Among Us Episode 2. So if you haven't watched Episode 1, there will be a link right down here in the description. Uh, if you have, then let's go. Let's play Episode 2. Um, what do I do? Oh yeah, click. <laughs> Quite excited for this. So last time we saw Snow's head outside of the... Mr. Toad? I'm Sarah. Not Mr. Toad. Do something, Big V. Before he completely tears up the place. Well, that was random. Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid cur? <laughs> 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 You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. Uh, it's, it's not what up. you it's might be thinking. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Come with me. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question! Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow! <laughs> no, I'm D. He's dumb. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. Holly, you're out of paper towels in the... They're gonna string me up, Bigby. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl named... Fuck, man! This fucking lap dog. They come sniffing around this part of town. The rich fucks in the woodlands need a shit. Ain't that right, Bigby? Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. So yeah, last time we saw Snow's head on the floor outside of um, the Woodlands building. And yeah. So let's play uh, episode two. That's such a good game. <laughs> You're making this more difficult than it has to be. If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. How are you feeling? I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. Uh, I need to find I'll the I'll be better when I find who did this. Which I can't do while sitting in here. We all want the same thing here, Big B. The damn Monday. Look, I know what you must be going through. Muggles. Really, I do. But I could use your cooperation. You know, I hate to say it, but I don't think you do. Of course. You're... you're right. I can't imagine what you're going through right now. What is it with you cops? Always trying to empathize with people. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? No. Didn't think so. Yeah, that shut her up. Yeah. 
Your nose is bleeding. <gasps> you Are okay? you okay? You don't look so good. Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. Uh, yeah. I know. I, I just said that. Is there something... Crazy, please. Please. I'm sorry. Just make it stop, please. What the fuck? We have to go, now. Oh. What did you do to her? She'll be fine. It's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive. But it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 hours. And everything they saw at the woodlands. Well, hurry up. We might want to take the photo with him. No. Instead of just leaving it there. For everyone to see. Like, hmm, I can't remember what I did last night. Oh look, a person a picture of a beheaded head. I wonder what that what happened. So good thing you took it though. Other oh, drinks are available. Fucking crazy, you bastard. I should thank you for the bit of love. Thanks for bailing me out. Certainly. We, um, we found Tweedledee chained up to a post. That was your doing, correct? Yeah. Well, I don't know why you detained him. Dee was at the trip trap when Snow was left at the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. Bluebeard's currently interrogating him. He does work And for he somebody. hasn't said anything useful. He's working for somebody. And whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. Maybe they're bosses. I said that person was suspicious. I know what you're thinking, Bigby. It's been one full night and a slice of morning, and I already miss her too. Mm. You know, I never get more homesick than when one of us dies. And now, were it to be snow, why don't you go I'm get your massage? These sorts of things. I just can't believe this is really happening. Oh. Our stories used to be so simple. We had a beginning, a middle, and an end. But ever since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. Did she um, give any indication to what she was thinking? When you saw her last, I mean. I don't know why, but I'd like to know that she was... I guess fine, I suppose. She was frustrated yeah. with him. She gave an indication she was pissed at you. By saying that she was pissed at you. At me? She was frustrated with the whole fucking system. I'm tired of having to turn fables away. It wore her down. I don't know what else to say, Big B. We have to have to put an end to this. If you didn't turn fables it's been down all the time. In as many days. If we don't unearth our culprit and soon, there will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. I'll get it done. Please, Bigby. For Miss White. I got it. Cool. It's like it's breaking cars, doesn't it? 
first Toe's car, then Crane's car, although I don't really care about Crane's car. 